scariest guy in the world, but the nicest guy in the world. He could be, he, I mean, every, look, when 98% of the people in the business are afraid of you, you pretty much could get your own way. And he never took advantage of that. He never used it. He never abused it. He was the nicest guy, still is the nicest guy when I see him. Uh, you know, in a business, in a physical business, a lot of times when you have uh, superior physical uh, skills or, you know, be able to, to, to take almost anybody at your will down, uh, you know, guys could take advantage of that sometime. And I never saw him take advantage of that. I know he's gotten in fights on the road, uh, you know, back in the day and gotten sued and stuff against, uh, you know, fans and bars and stuff. Um, when I had met him, he had, wasn't drinking anymore because he had said that was what, what would make him go off. But always a gentleman. Uh, I had him over to my house for 4th of July barbecues, great to my wife and kids. I got nothing bad to say about Ming. And uh, like, I, like most probably everybody you've interviewed has said, uh, probably other than Barbarian, the toughest guy. And Barbarian and Ming would have to fight to see who's, who's, who's tougher, but the two toughest guys probably in the business history.